Hey guys, welcome to my Geek Rant. So today I'm going to be finally talking about Avatar again. Um, so Smoke and Shadow, the graphic novel that continues the Avatar The Last Airbender storyline, uh, released a few weeks ago, I believe three weeks ago, uh, but I'm going to review it now. And um, I really enjoyed it. I, I think it really, really captured the tone of Avatar. Like even when reading some of the characters, I could put the voice of uh, Sokka or Katara or Aang or Zuko. I could like hear their voices as they were speaking and it worked out really well that way. I also really like the storyline. Um, the Fire Nation is, some of the people in Fire Nation uh, disapprove of what of what Zuko is doing. They um, feel he's being a little bit too lax, he's being a little bit too nice to the other nations because of course the Fire Nation had built up a bunch of colonies within the Earth Kingdom and now they're, the Earth Kingdom is asking that the Fire Nation go back to their own island and all that stuff. That, that was a conflict with some of the other comic books, but it continues here. And so there's a faction that wants to overthrow Zuko. And I felt the way that they handled it, even though it comes from like a spirit, like there's a spirit at the beginning of the uh, book that's like, if you don't overthrow Zuko, we're going to like, you know, take your children or whatever. I forget what the uh, the reasoning was or what the threat was. But I do like that somewhat, at least, there is a natural progression of the story and of a society or a faction of a society that disapproves of Zuko. And they make a fair point of saying that Zuko is being a little bit too lax. He is... Um, he's not putting his nation first, and and that's the reason why they're um, fighting against him, which I thought was kind of interesting. I think that was a, a good little uh, play into the the progression of the storyline. I also like uh, the bit that we have with uh, Mei and Tai Lee. They're helping Zuko again, even though uh, Mei is a little bit still heartbroken and things like that. But I like to see that they were in this comic again, and we got to see what they were doing. And uh, also, I, I like the scenes with uh, Mei and her new boyfriend, um, how she was like playing that up and, and all that. The only criticism I would have of these comics in particular, I think would be the action. I don't know if they're translating very well, or if they're drawn very, very well. Um, I don't think that uh, the action is so kinetic in the, uh, the, the series, whether it's Legend of Korra or Avatar The Last Airbender. But in the comics, I don't think they really come over as well. Though I do like, I do appreciate that at one point in the comic when Zuko was fighting some of the um, some of the Fire Nation uh, rebels, he uses his technique. He uses his dragon technique, which we actually never really got to see in the Avatar series. But we see here in the comic book, we actually see him using some of the techniques that he learned from the dragons and employing them against you know these other Fire Nation rebels. And I, I, I when I saw that, I was like, oh my god, that's the dragons! Like that's totally what he learned. And and I kind of like you know had a little fanboy moment for that. But yeah, I really like this comic a lot. I think it captures every single character very well. All the Iroh scenes were hilarious. Um, he's still a very good fighter, but He's still extremely funny and like carefree and things like that. And I'm also interested to see where this is headed to because uh, they do allude to Azula returning possibly. We also have this whole business with the spirits and Aang has to come in and help out with the spirits. This, you know, this dark spirit that's you know, like tormenting the Fire Nation right now and all that kind of stuff. Um, but yeah, uh, I would definitely recommend it for sure. If you like Avatar in the least, I think you'll definitely, it's, it's a breath of fresh air if you, if it's, it's been a long time since we had the last comic book and a very long time since we had the series um, out almost a year now. So this is very nice just to get back into the flow of the world and the universe. And it's really nice. Uh, but that's it. Of course, peace, love. And remember, be water, my friend. <laughs>